I don't think the old national anthem did a good job in uniting us as a nation. The generations like us won't get the opportunity to learn this uh, new national anthem because where do we recite it? We don't go to assembly where we recite national anthem. So to me personally, I prefer the old national anthem. <laughs> My people, have you heard the latest gist? But it's just about Nigeria changing her national anthem to a new one. Which, by the way, really isn't a new anthem. This new old anthem <laughs> was actually the very first anthem that Nigeria had before the whole arise of compatriot that we now know was introduced. There has been a case of a lecturer asking his students to write the lyrics of the Nigerian anthem. The formal old new Nigerian anthem, if you know what I mean. Now, guess what? Two different lecturers at two different universities in the country have asked their students to write down the lyrics of the new old Nigerian anthem as part of their assessment test. Can you imagine? What do students really think about what these lecturers did? You do not want to miss this one. Now, let us dive into the drama. Okay, so Princess, I would like to ask you, what do you think about the new national anthem? It's not great. Thing, I don't really like it. I've not even learnt it. <laughs> what happens you learnt it? Well, the thing is so stressful. Like, they just change everything. Well, the thing is not okay for me. Oh. Thinking is not okay. There are other pressing issues in the country. We have the issue of hardship and this um, insecurity going on in the country. So that one is one of the mind, like, they're not supposed to even think about that one now. They should face other higher issues in the country before thinking of changing the national anthem. We have more problems that is more higher. <laughs> and the national anthem. I don't think it's going to, going to help the country. To me, I think it's, it, it's not fair. And to, uh, I imagine myself being in that show. I think it's very stressful to them. Because a lot of students have things that is bothering them. Are you bringing um, new national anthem for them to sing as part of the assessment? I think it's very wrong. Well, honestly speaking, I don't think the old national anthem did a good job in uniting us as a nation. Well, it didn't really play a role. So I still don't think the new national anthem is playing any role to unite us as a nation. I don't think they did because they did it in such a hasty manner, right? They should have given at least the citizens like some time frame at least so that they can get accustomed to it a little bit. They just did it out of nowhere and, and then they are now expecting us to learn it uh, from scratch again. All of, a All of a sudden, yes. Personally, I prefer the old national anthem. Okay. Because uh, that's what everybody has been used to. Since we are in mm. primary school, we are already used to it. To me, I don't feel like uh, national anthem really matters. So, like, there are more critical issues to tackle in the country than national anthem. So, they could have left that old one for us to continue with it because that's what everybody has been used to. So, like, generations like us won't get the opportunity to learn this uh, new national anthem because where do we recite it? We don't go to assembly where we recite national anthem. So to me personally, I prefer the old national anthem. I have some personal issues that is bothering me that's not this national anthem. And I don't think it's relevant for government to even, you know, fix a new national anthem aside the old one, drop the old one because this national anthem, I don't, I can't even sing it at all. <laughs> I even prefer the old one that I've, I've, I've started singing since my nursery school <laughs> than this present one, so it's not relevant to me at all. I don't think uh, there's need of even uh, changing the national anthem because we have uh, problems like uh, insecurity, we have uh, problems like uh, poverty and hunger in the land, even have uh, some problem of, uh, uh, what do you call it? Kidnapping. Kidnapping and so on and so forth. So. There is no relationship between changing the national anthem and uh, these things that are happening in the country. Instead, the government should, fo uh, should focus on solving such problems. This was not what we were expecting from the government. Mm. This was all of a sudden, like, we were expecting a better change. All of a sudden, the change was the national anthem. <laughs> and, <laughs> change in our change. <laughs> the change was the national anthem. Like, it was so unexpected. We were expecting something much better. And it doesn't make you feel more patriotic because Wait, there was the time you want to learn it. Like, example is, an example is this the last match, like this nation, last national match, the players could not sing it. Yeah. You were just confused. Like, you were looking at each other, they could not say, they could not say, because it doesn't, I, if you look at it that way, from that perspective, they don't look more patriotic. So, the, the, it doesn't make you feel more patriotic. I don't see the wide reason to change it. I don't see. You are more, there are many things to change the insecurity, 
the employment, unemployment, many issues to solve. But it's the national anthem the government focused on to change the national anthem. Ah, no, now. The people that can, like, even this national anthem, the national anthem, people that would love to learn it more, that can learn it easier, is secondary school and primary, because every day on the assembly ground they say, but like this when the university, you only come for lectures, you don't say the national anthem. Yeah, yeah. It's on maybe on grand occasions that you just yeah. say it. And I might not be surprised on a grand occasion when they will say it, people will be mumbling. So it doesn't improve anything, it doesn't make you feel more. You know, when you want to make a child take a bitter medicine, maybe you come with a sweetener, something that the child is going to like. Speak. You get, like, okay, if you want to give the child best, you can come with caprison. Maybe you put it in the caprison, or after giving the caprison, put the drug in the caprison container, and then give the child. Because okay, I think if they like, like, they brought down the rate of dollar or something, as in worked on that, and then told us that the national anthem had a connection to that, like the national, ah, okay, or let's say they brought back. No, neither will add value in the old part. So they brought that rate and then told us that the national anthem, it was because of the brother and the lady, so the national anthem had connection to that. <laughs> I think all of ah, we will sing down. <laughs> Further into getting the opinion of Nigerian citizens, a publication about this lecturer's actions was made on my school news TV website. It has gone viral as a lot of netizens were surprised and they have a lot to say about this lecturer's action. Some were in support of it, saying that students should know a little about everything and that as patriotic citizens, know your national anthem is the sign of patriotism. Others opposed, saying that the lecturer was wrong as learning the lyrics of the new old Nigerian anthem isn't a part of the school's curriculum and the lecturer was simply trying to put the students in a tight spot by making them to recite the new old anthem just so that they could fail. And there you have it, my people. The new old national anthem has said plenty of talk. But whether you like it or you are still on the fence, one thing is clear. Learning this new old Nigerian anthem can be fun as it is a chance for us to show our pride and heritage as Nigerian citizens. Let us re-embrace the national anthem and make it our own. It is a part of our identity as Nigerian citizens. And hey, singing this new anthem might just make us united and give us a sense of togetherness as Nigerians. Thank you for watching today's episode. Thank you for joining us. Do not forget to like, to subscribe and to share. I am Salomi.